Hi, I'm Marius from MWS Photography and in this video we are going to have a look at the brand new FlashQ wireless flash triggering system from Lightpix Labs. Now before we open up the box to see which goodies are inside, first I want to show you why I'm so excited about seeing what these little guys can do. Now my normal transceivers, so this unit can transmit and receive, you just change it on the side here, are about this size. Now, on my Nikon SLR camera, it's not really such a big thing. If you look at the size, it actually complements the camera with the larger transceiver unit because the camera is much larger. But the moment I go over to my Fuji X-T1 mirrorless system, then if you hold it like that, it becomes a problem because this unit is terribly large. And this is my transmitter or transceiver, but I set it to transmit. And I've got two or three receivers controlling two or three flash units. So it really becomes a very bulky um, set you need to carry along with your camera. Where with this unit, now inside this box, this is the FlashQ Kit F+. Plus. Because this one has got a transmitter and two receivers. You also get the one that's got um, one transmitter and one receiver. This one has got an extra receiver in the box. And if you take the size difference, just look at that. It's almost the size, this is almost the size of this entire kit. And this box is not as big as the units are. So I'm really excited to see what they can do. Now let's open up the box and see what hides inside. Okay, when we open the box on the inside, you will find a yellow piece of paper telling you about the power button if you need to long press it um, for three seconds to turn it on. There's also a little quick manual showing you where the but or what the buttons are for as well as where the battery comes in. There's also a little operation summary. I'll still read through these to see how everything works. Then I really love how they package it, packaged this entire set in this box. Um, Okay, let's take this out. Then at the back here, here we find our sync cables. You want to attach it to studio strobes. And then here we've got our units. At the back, they're locked in place there. It can easily be removed. Okay, so this is our transmitter. And as you can see, it's really tiny. And here we've got a receiver as well as another receiver. What I enjoy about the flash queue system is the tiny size factor of each unit. So if I use my Cactus V6, another set I've got, not by the same company of course, you'll notice these unit, units are much larger. I must also add they do have more advanced features but we're only comparing now the size difference of the units. So this unit I will turn to transmit to TX and I'll put it on top of my camera. These two units I will turn to RX and then they will be my receivers. I'll put flashes on top of them. Now, if you take the flash queue, just look at the size. This is awesome. Compare this to this unit. Um, so this is perfect for my mirrorless system. So this will be my transmitter and these two are my receivers. Really cool. Okay, that's all for this unboxing. In the next video, we'll have a close-up look at these units. We'll go over the specifications and then we'll put them to use with a two-light setup. So see you in the next video. Bye.